guys, so I filmed this video like three times and I just realized my audio was off. So that sucks. So I'm just gonna be doing these faces again because I did film this video like getting ready with me, but I don't really feel like editing it right now and I have to start my homework really soon. I was supposed to start it in five minutes. So we'll see how that goes. Um, so under my eyes today, I'm wearing the Maybelline Dream Lumi. That's Spanish. Dream Lumi Touch Highlighting Concealer. And this is an ivory. Um, it's just under my eyes. And this is just like the pen one. You just like click it at the bottom. And it's just like a little pen. And I really like this um, for under my eyes. So yeah. And then, of course, I'm wearing my Rimmel Stay Matte Pressed Powder in Transparent. This is my favorite powder ever. It's amazing. And I feel like I'm going to hit pan soon. So it's, like, really caved in. And I can see that little circle. Can't see it from far away. See it? Oh, my gosh. Do you see that shadow? That, like, driving me crazy. See it? Right there. Right there. So, yeah. Um, I don't know, though. So, we'll just have to see. And then on my cheeks, I'm wearing my Benefit Cozy Tint, which is just a bubble gum cheek and lip stain. I am just wearing it on my cheeks, though. Yeah. And then I'm wearing my Benefit High Beam. And if you haven't seen my Sephora haul yet, you need to go check that out, or this video just, like, won't make sense. I'm wearing my Benefit High Beam highlighter. And, um... Yeah, I mean, that's what that looks like. I'm sure you've all seen it before. And then I'm just wearing my Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. And I had to take the stopper out so it's, like, dying. Or, I mean, it looks funny. I don't know. The packaging is dying. Look at it. Oh, my gosh. And then I have my Revlon Cream Eyeshadows and Skin Lights. This color right here. Of course, I don't know how I haven't hit pan on it yet, but I have it. And as soon as I hit pan on it, though, I will go, like, buy a backup. And then I'm wearing my Naked 2 palette today, which I'm super excited about. Um, again, if you didn't watch my video, so it makes sense, I taped the brush. So, yeah. And then um, the colors I said I wasn't going to use, Tease, because I thought it was, like, purple. It's, like, totally not. I don't know what was wrong with me. It's like a light matte brown. Oh my gosh. You see it? It's like not purple. I don't know what I was thinking. So it's, oh my god. Sorry, it's like really smooth. I just spit in it. Yummy. That's what it looks like right there. And then, but since I probably will use that, I actually did discover another eyeshadow I will probably use, which is Chopper. And that color is, like, really orange. You can see it right there. And oranges look so bad on me. Like, melon pigment, that is so pretty, but I can't wear it because it's, like, orange. It looks awful on me. Um, but on to what I'm wearing. If you watch my Sephora haul, which I really hope you all did, um, Verb. I couldn't shut up about it, so I had to wear it today. That's it right there. It's super gorgeous. Oh, my gosh. And then I'm wearing pistol in my crease with it. So, there's my little look. And then I am wearing foxy on my brow bone, which is hair. It looks really boring, but seriously, like, favorite brow bone color ever. Like, I always like my brow bone colors to be matte and then my inner corners to be shimmery. This is, like, my favorite brow bone color of all time oh my gosh I can't even explain so yeah that's what I'm wearing and then on my inner corner I'm wearing the covergirl eyeshadow and champagne of course and I have made a pretty decent dent in this so that's exciting and then I'm wearing the e.l.f. mascara primer on my eyes. Oh my gosh, I'm so sweet down already. And then CoverGirl Lash Blast Fusion Water Resistant. This is really light. I think it's like getting close to gone. And I don't have a clump on the end anymore. 
But this is my favorite mascara of all time, so I will repurchase this. I got the mascara, like, on my hand. Sorry. Um, I will be repurchasing this. This is my favorite mascara of all time. And it's purple, guys. Like, who doesn't want a purple mascara? So, I love this, and I would definitely recommend it. And then, of course, I'm wearing my Maybelline Great Lash um, Clear on my eyebrows. It's, like, every day. Not exciting. And then, on my lips... I am wearing my Fresh Sugar Rose um, Tinted Lip Balm with SPF 15, and I really, really like this. And then I'm wearing, lastly, my um, Urban Decay Lip Junkie in Naked, and this is just like a really pretty berry with Silver Shimmer, and it's just a squeezy tube. And I'm probably going to buy the full size of this because I love it. Like, I'm not kidding. I'm probably going to buy the full size of this. Oh, my gosh. I love it so much. And look at the packaging. See how cool that is? Oh, my gosh. So I'm probably going to buy the full size. i got to see how much it is, though, because if it's, like, $30, I probably won't. But if it's, like, $20, then I probably will. So, yeah, I love this thing. It's amazing. I love it. So, yeah. That is my face of the day. I'll give you a close-up really quick. And, as it looks look like. Ah. Um, so, yeah, thanks for watching, and please subscribe. And leave me any requests you have down below. Um, so thanks for watching and please subscribe. Bye. And, oh my gosh, please get me to 500 subscribers. You don't even know. Oh my gosh. So, yeah. Love you. Bye.